CD number two. Tell us about it. Uh, it's called Trail in Life. It's, uh, you know, I guess, two years since our last record. And this record is actually in stores. Uh, the first record, the distribution was kind of here and there and everywhere, so it was hard to pick it up. But this, uh, this we went to HMV today and it was everywhere, so uh, that's, that was pretty exciting this morning. But it's, it's a rockin' record. Whenever I try to write a record, I try to write something that uh, you'd want to just put in your car and go for a drive. And, and uh, you know, once again, just like the first record, I'm drawing on a lot of songwriting, uh, you know, images and stuff from back home. So there's a lot of me in this record, too. It's, it's like anybody else out there right now who is, you know, just working jobs, trying to survive, to now being a CCMA award winner and on your second album. Hey, has it hit you yet? I don't know. You know, we're so busy all the time that it's, uh, I know last year when I, when I got single of the year for Brothers, it didn't hit me until we actually had some time off and we were out at the ocean and, and, uh, and the award came in. The award came and we put it on the table and it was just, it was really kind of, that's when it hit me. It was mind, mind blowing. It came in the mail. When you come out to an event like this, people are lining up to, to get your autograph. I mean, that's kind of cool, but how much cooler is it when you look out into a crowd and, and they're singing your songs back to you? Uh, it's really cool. Yeah. This summer, and uh, I think it was Dolphin, we, uh, we hadn't sung Wildflower yet. It had just, you know, just run its course of radio, and this is our first live show. And we started singing Wildflower, and the crowd was singing it back louder than, than uh, me and the boys. So that was pretty cool. It's always cool when people sing your songs. It's, uh, I think, the ultimate compliment, because you know that they listen to it, and they take it in, and they, uh, they live the song with you. And uh, I think at some point I'll have to get one of those donut seats, you know, that help help with your rear end from like flying so much. You know, you can. Uh, my butt gets sore like three three hours into the flight, so I'm gonna have to get like a. Mm. You're gonna have to get like a donut. I don't have hemorrhoids, but one of those hemorrhoid pillows that the you know makes it comfortable. And you, of course, you can edit that out. Like, feel free. To, why why do my know. interviews always go this way? Why does this always happen to me? <laughs> oh boy. <laughs>